What is going on, everybody? It is a beautiful day here in Devil's Lake, North Dakota. Big Tone, what's going on, man? Well, today uh, we have this fifth wheel that my boy Aaron is selling. Aaron, what's the story on this fifth wheel, sir? Well, I'm getting something warmer for the winter time, so I'm gonna get rid of this. I love it, but time to go. What year and model is this Montana? It's a 14, 375 FLF or something like that it's called. We'll get some other sites on there. The thing that I noticed about this coach that really intrigues me is that the front living fifth wheel. How long have you owned this coach for? Three years. Three years, okay. Yep, yep. And I love it. It um, has every, plenty of storage. Can we open that up real quick just to see? Sure. And it, what is it, four or five slide outs? Five slide outs. Five slide outs, wow. Huge pass through. And it has a nice little thing to winterize in here too. It's kind of a nice little thing I like. You just trim it and flip it and winterize it. Oh, that's cool. Like a... Yep, make it easy. Very cool. Flip a switch and it's winterized. These are huge slide outs too. I'm I'm curious at how big, uh, how big inside this coach is. And uh, it is a beautiful day out here in North Dakota. Looks like they were playing a little uh, cornhole there. I like, like your my style. Ready to go. Yep, <laughs> yep. <laughs> Hard to mess out here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we, yeah, we just knocked the dust off of it, so they just moved all the furniture out here. Oh, nice exterior entertainment area there. Yeah, I like that. With the speakers there as well. Yeah. Look at my Roku with the mobile hotspot, my cell phone. You get all the thing out here. It's pretty nice. Nice. Tell them what do you think about this, man? I can't wait to get inside and see. <laughs> nice. Big Tone, have you ever been in a, a front living? This is huge. Yeah. <laughs> you mind killing that AC just for the yep. uh, the sound? It is a warm day outside, so he's got the ACs blasting. It's nice and cool in here. The ACs are definitely working well. Let's take a look here. You were saying that you really like the front living yeah, area. Is, for me, it's uh, the old bedroom up here. You always got it's two, two tight quarters, you know? So this here, you can hang out. You got the recliner chair. And um, these turn into beds here. Nice. Nice air, nice air mattresses. They both fold out, yep. nice recliner right here. There's a little partition here if you want to keep people. Oh, that's cool, kind of like a second bedroom. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Nice, yeah. now Big Tone, we, let's put it let's to the test, the here. test here. <laughs> if there's anybody that's 6'9", dude, you can stand straight up, man. Yeah. Yeah. Nice, <laughs> nice, and that's I, in the front here. I would never guess that, I would yeah. never guess that. Wow. Uh, uh. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, so yeah. it has a little fireplace thing there, I like that, and it, uh... That's, that's your son, huh? Yeah, there's a little baby there. You got the little fireplace going. Nice. That Just a, or, So that's all done by a control there? Yep. Remote, control, remote control fireplace? Yep. Now, does the fireplace create heat as yes, well? Yes, it does. Nice, yeah. Two, two settings of heat. I stay in here to about, with I have a heater in the back, a little extra heater in the back, and this heater here, and about 25 degrees, I'm comfortable in here. Anything below 25, you got to turn the <laughs> furnace on. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't quite keep up. Nice. Then I, my favorite part, uh, this here's kind of nice, you know, it slides out with a big table nice. if you want. Yeah, absolutely. And it has plenty of counter space here when this pops up. Yeah, and, and I have to uh, point out too, this is such an open floor plan. I used to have a uh, 44 foot KZ Inferno toy hauler and everything was so broken up that it, it felt smaller, but really like, Big tone, how much you, you can you even touch the ceiling? <laughs> yeah, I can. <laughs> flat, flat footed, yeah. I mean, just super open feeling. I can't, I can't even pull a fifth wheel, okay? <laughs> I can't, but the the, the bumper hitch ones, it's just too, too claustrophobic for me. So, once I got into a fifth wheel, I go, This is for me, man. This, yeah. is, this is the way it's going. This, this is, is huge, a lot more open. yeah. And you've got all kinds of storage Tons up of there. Space. Huge cabinets that go all the way up. Not a fridge, but I guess it works, it works fine. It kind of like the Tiffin one with the, the way it opens. Yeah, I think that's the same fridge that I have in my Tiffin Phaeton. It's a Norcold, yeah. Very nice. Uh, gas and electric refrigerator. Yep. Yep. Yes, gas and electric, yeah. Look at the speaker. Ooh, that, that's some noise to it right there. Right here? Yeah. <laughs> that's nice. I got that for $99 at Walmart. Wow. Like, that thing rocks. Nice, nice. I love speakers. Now, for the right amount of money, will you throw that in? <laughs> <laughs> This this is what I like about the best right here. Wow, this is 
This does not feel like a normal fifth wheel. Big tone. A lot of space, man. I like That's this. <laughs> yeah, and that mid, the bathroom kind of separates the, the whole. Yeah. Wow, this is. You can, nice part about it, you can get around and make the bed. Other ones, yep. you know, you can't really get to them. So yeah. You get to it pretty easy. Plenty of storage in here. You have wardrobe on both sides yep. there. Yep. Is that a whole slide out, huh? The whole slide out. The, the whole slide yeah. out. Yep. That's cool. Yeah. That's whole, yeah point out like we're three big dudes walking around in here and like plenty of space in here <laughs> like, wow RV, look how tall the rv door is like. yeah seriously yeah that's that's the first rv door i think big tone didn't have to duck down under like arizona right here <laughs> the bathroom here uh is there a washer dryer in here yeah, it has a hookup for it I don't know okay there. there's a hookup for washer in there i got much much of stuff stored in there now yeah, so huge it's storage yeah it's just a bunch of trash in there put in there for your video <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All good, all good. But organic. Yeah, absolutely. And and a huge uh huge shower too. Big tone, you want to just show people <laughs> Big Tone's got like three, four feet of head clearance. Uh, I can see it's got a typical gas stove, but it fires up every time perfectly. Oh, that's for cool. Me. Look at the fold the fold out thing. Yeah, it just folds up furs away here and it's never let me down until now I try it for the Oh look at that. Boom. Fires yeah. right up. Yep. Good deal. Works good. Oven works good on it too. Nice. So you're you're selling this coach. This coach is located here in Devil's Lake, North Dakota. Yes. How much are you asking for this coach? I'd take twenty eight thousand bottom line for it. Twenty eight thousand. Not, not not dime less. That's firm. That's firm. I greatly appreciate that, and I've talked about it in, in other videos that I, I don't like to play the whole haggle game. No, no. Throw out your non-negotiable number. If you want it, bring 28K right. and pick it up. If not, don't even bother calling. So, yeah. <laughs> I, I buy and sell a lot of houses. I flip houses. I appraise houses. When I sell a house, my price is firm every time. I don't, I'd say, this is what I want for it. You don't want to buy it? Don't bring me an offer. Waste your time, realtors. I, so, I respect same, same way here. I, just say, I, I respect that. Big Tone, you remember when we talked about that in an RV sales mm -hmm. video? Yeah, this is this is a point that's been up. Now, so so Aaron, if uh, any serious buyers happen to see this coach on YouTube, is there an email address or phone number that they can get a hold of you? Yeah, at? tell me at uh, area code seven zero one two three eight four three nine zero, or my email address is aa appraisals at dactel dot com. Well, I greatly appreciate you letting me and Big Tone see inside of this coach. We're out here goofing off in North Dakota and. Uh, just this is a random we were not expecting to make this video this well, is totally random but i want to say something i watch these guys clean my friend's coach and they did a little wash job in this coach here these guys are incredible what they do this this is top-notch professional stuff here let me tell you <laughs> yeah I, I i greatly appreciate that now that that work is not cheap by the way we're up here in north dakota because his buddy is having us do a lot of work so uh but we we greatly appreciate all of you watching these videos uh, Big Tone, any last words for the YouTube subscribers out there, bud? You guys know what to do. Make sure you subscribe. <laughs> hey, we greatly appreciate all of you. Hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again.